Ok, capítulo 7. <laughs> ah, we're still moving against the Roman. Let's see what we can do in here. It's getting kind of messy. So we're moving against this other city, which was under the one that we captured. Just we just move forward a couple minutes. Uh, the reason is because the game is getting too long, right? <laughs> getting way too long. If you compare that with the last one that we did with the Arabs, so just gonna try to move a little bit, right? Okay, our wall because we don't want to lose that what we just accomplished. And then start getting some spies, right? So uh, I'm gonna try to move my cruisers here. See if they can provide me some naval support. And after that, will be just a couple of um, inches away to attack Rome itself, right? Ooh, it's still very powerful. Wow. That's kind of scary. Oh, that's because they have the wall also. That's why. Alright, so... We'll see what we're doing. Still producing troops, troops. So the game is going... It's moving too fast. I'm still not sure what's gonna happen. So I just need to be ready in case of a big fight, right? And it's at the same time, I'm building the Manhattan Project in case something get out of hand, right? In case I hear that somebody's going for some kind of victory, I can get ready, get in position, and actually use like a, a little bomb, you know. And uh, after that capturing, and trying to control the threat. Ah, it's just the ace, just the ace that you need to keep always available in case something got complicated, right? Or more complicated than what you think. Uh, so far, doing okay. Still building some. Those cities that I got from the Japanese are helping me a lot. Um, in for map controlling, basically, right? Oh wow, this one has the. There's a lot of wonders in there, and that's why the the, the Roman also gets the wonders when they play in, uh, especially in Deity. All of a sudden, he start pumping. Well, we already got the the Hanging Gardens in there, um, and I got the Colossus in this other one. Let's see if we can do something about it. I don't know if I have enough for a ring of spies. Eh, that would be good. Or maybe I can rush one. No, it's right here. Perfect. So let's see if we can do something, destroy something, or um, or or something. <laughs> We're gonna wait one more turn. Oh, go for him! Yeah, would be nice. Come on, it's only one. Girls, God damn it, ladies! <laughs> ah, okay. I need to use the force only to break this defense. Uh, infiltration. Hopefully this will do it. I'm kind of afraid of the odds in this game. So far I have some very freaky weird situations. And I don't want to rely on those kind of things, right? Because it gets too dangerous. So we're going to use first always the two armies with infiltration. Uh, allow me to break the first line of defense. And after that, I don't know if I can. Yeah, maybe I can do it. Why not? Yeah, the city walls are the one that produces so much uh, defense. So that's why I was trying to use my spy, actually, not to steal anything. I'm just trying to probably get rid of the walls, right? Because that's the first uh, building that you can destroy once that you are. Uh, um, if you select the option, destroy a building in um, in an enemy space. That's a fair option. Go for the walls first, right? So, well, it looks like this one is going down. And, uh, and I'm glad I decided to move ahead so fast, right? Because, oh, nice. Let's do it. <laughs> Things are looking good. Looks like uh, we are getting very close to a culture victory all of a sudden. <laughs> you never know, right? Where well, we can change that and, and surprise everybody with this. I got my submarines in there hanging around and it's been kind of weird just a couple of things that I'm uh, that's the only problem when you have islands that you probably overthink too much on what to do I should probably just go for buildings and get something going but um, 
trying to provide some support in case of the... I don't know how tough it's going to be the French. I believe it's going to be a very difficult opponent. So I'm not going to take any chances. Uh. For now, I'm just going to focus on the Romans. So whatever happened, it did the the French for ABC reason wants to be in peace for now, but well take him. Like, you gotta be intelligent. Come on, you can be in war against everybody. Well you're in war against everybody anyway, but <laughs> you guys know what I mean, right? You no you don't need an extra headache for nothing. Uh hey, this is not good. This is not good. I'm gonna get close to Rome. And uh will that will help me a lot. Let's see if we can get closer. And with the naval support, we should probably be able to take, hopefully, uh, one capital. In this case, is Rome, which is kind of complicated. Uh, yes, you can come too, because we need as much naval support as possible, right? See, because remember, this one also get the bonus of the the palace, so. So now I think they need to consider when you attack a capital, right? But so far it looks like we have this area under control. Uh, good, 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 good. So if I got Rome under my control, if I can get under my control, I can start planning well. It's gonna be my next movement, and actually, what kind of victory we're gonna be pursuing if we can make it through, right? So far, it looks like the defense of the yeah, the defense of the Roman is not that strong after all. That's because we spend so much stuff building little knights and riflemen, and the advantage of what I'm doing right now with the, um, the Spanish is that uh, I was able to uh, take advantage of those bonuses, like uh, well, navigation, right? Because that allowed me to. Uh, to make my cities close to the sea growing extremely fast because I I got the well of course for that so that's that's the kind of things that I'm probably I'm already say that like a thousand times <laughs> I'm, sure, I'm gonna just I'm gonna wait for you guys to say every time I repeat something too many times just put it in the comments okay because sometimes I don't even uh, paying attention just so focused in the game and trying to give all the best commentary possible that sometimes I don't realize that I'm saying something way too many times, right? So, exactly, you gotta really need to, uh, I'm sure I, I say this many times, but who the hell care? Anyway, yeah, you gotta use the bonuses um, to use it for your advantage, but um, the game itself is played by, just don't overthink yourself too much. I mean, you are like a, and you can don't just trying to go for the for the bonuses and say okay I'm playing with the Arab or I just going for the economy victory and there's nothing else I can do no that's not true you can win with every civilization the any any way possible all right it's all about changing your, your strategy in the middle of the game all right doing some modifications like uh, we we just do we just did in this game right because uh, we jump from a very pacific, relaxed um, civilization to a very aggressive one. Uh, the reason is very clear. We were getting threat by the Roman, so it was a perfect time to put a stop in that, right? All right, so enough talking. Let's go to action, all right? Because time keep rolling, and this game is looks like a marathon already, right? Come on, it's only one. We need. We can do that. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Let's see, if we can start getting some great person. I'm sure he has a couple. Come over here, can we, Papa? Another thinker. That's pretty good. Thinker, thinker. If we are lucky, we'll be able to. Ah, this one already have a 50% culture bonus, so. I don't know, maybe my culture is not that strong enough yet to start flipping switch, uh, flipping cities, right? And if a city has a wall, I can't do anything either. So. 
Ah, screw it, let's go for this. Trying to get Ron under control and then we'll think what we're gonna do with the rest of the stuff, right? Um, and it looks like this guy is gonna go down very soon. Just in a couple more turns. And I don't, I don't know, I don't like, I don't like when I see my tanks rolling back. <laughs> that is a bad sign, right? <laughs> it looks like, a, okay, something's going on this way. Looks like the odds are not in our favor, so... Alright, looks like if you're defending with tanks, that means that you don't have nothing. So we should be able to get rid of... Whoa, <laughs> You guys saw that guy flying? <laughs> Isn't that awesome? <laughs> oh, that was great. Okay. I won't laugh, I'm sorry. But <laughs> I just saw a Roman flying across the map. There you go. Ta -da. Finally. Finally, finally. We take care of the Roman, which was very good. And let me think about you. Now. Oh my. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's be peaceful for now. Considering the fact that uh, I think you're almost done. You lost most of the big cities. So I can probably focus myself on something else, right? Because winning technology still. Oh wow, the culture is still the. the. the Roman. I don't know, maybe I will give, <laughs> I will make another visit to you, maybe with some spies and trying to get those really fancy great person that you're controlling, right? Mm -hmm. In the meantime, I'm trying to, every capture city is going to gold production, I'm trying to be ready in case something happens. And I guess it's time to think in the French or in the Japanese. Yes, let's try to get all the forces together one more time. Now that we have this under control. And now we can start planning our next evil move. Yeah. Okay. Oh, submarine. How many submarines do I have? I think I have another one here. Come on, stay with your bodies. Right here. Jeez, they're so crappily slow. <laughs> Only two movements for turn and that's that sucks yes uh, I know they're very powerful by the way against the uh, uh, some other naval units so that's the only reason we're trying to take control absolutely of this but um but it looks like so far it looks like uh, things will relax a little bit now that the the Roman is is in peace and actually under control, so now I can probably go back and start building a couple of things that I had pending. Yeah, good, 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 good. Uh, stay there, stay there, stay there. See if we can start building some other thing. Uh, probably the Japanese will be. I I will go against this, the the French because uh, the fact that uh, I'm sure is. <laughs> Very strong at this point because I haven't, I haven't be able to, to harassment him that much during the game. So I'm sure he's got a bunch of stuff going. Sure, so have some tanks and everything. So we need to get ready for war again. Okay, advance fly very soon. Not too bad. Twelve cities for nothing. So we'll see. Um, Pum pum. Yeah. Okay. Oh, ooh. stop moving around, buddy. Oh, and now we are first in culture, right? Okay. Now it make more sense. <laughs> Finally. Oh, my fighters! Sorry, dude. I forgot. It's only two turns. I'm sorry. <laughs> um. The no, yeah, now we're ahead in culture because we captured Rome and it wasn't counting that until now. So we'll see. Oh yeah, of course we always can get a new city. Beautiful. Things are looking very good. Nagoya is ours. So, well, I don't know. Looks like things are looking a little bit better. Uh, we'll find out what happened in the next videos.